Imagine living your life peacefully, following the paths the world dictates, until one day you start noticing something strange. There are signs that only you can see, a restlessness that arises from nowhere, as if a silent voice were calling you to something you don't fully understand. You find yourself gazing at the stars, seeking answers in the wind, feeling that there's an invisible connection guiding every step you take. A secret purpose, a hidden mission, etched in your soul since time immemorial. Today, I want to speak especially to those who feel the weight of being chosen, who bear the burden of the call, and who, perhaps, have considered giving up. I encourage you to stay with me until the end of this message, for there is something powerful waiting for you, something that will rekindle your faith, restore your hope, and strengthen your spirit. Don't miss the fullness of what God is ready to reveal to your heart today. Often it is in the final moments that the breakthrough happens and clarity manifests. Being chosen means understanding that God's call comes with a price. This price is not translated into material goods, but rather into intense challenges, periods of isolation, and renunciations that distance us from what is familiar. Despite the sacrifices, there is a promise of an extraordinary reward for those who keep the faith. Being chosen goes beyond recognition. It is a spiritual responsibility that inscribes in your soul a singular purpose, also marked by a cost. However, do not lose heart, for what we face here is small compared to the eternal reward that awaits us. Being chosen is not a conscious decision, but a silent recognition that goes beyond common understanding. It is as if the universe had marked you with an invisible symbol, a sacred seal that few can decipher. This call is deep, mysterious, and often accompanied by doubts and uncertainties. Why you? Why now? You did not ask for this, but something greater chose your life for a purpose that transcends logic and defies the ordinary. If you are not yet subscribed, take the opportunity to subscribe, like the video, and activate notifications to stay updated with God's Word. The cost of being chosen involves sacrifice. Let's be honest. Being chosen by God often means being set apart, which can bring a feeling of isolation. It implies following a path that many around you will not understand. Think of Abraham, who was called to leave his land and go to a place that God would show him. Imagine the uncertainty and fear he must have felt. Yet he obeyed, sacrificing the comfort of the familiar for the unknown journey with God. There is a magnetism that draws you to the unknown, a feeling that there is something more that has not yet been revealed. Perhaps you have noticed small details that repeat, coincidences that seem more than mere chance. The truth is that destiny works in ways that the human mind cannot grasp, weaving invisible threads that connect events, people, and circumstances, leading you to a point where the extraordinary becomes possible. You begin to realize that there is more than what the eyes can see, and that your path has been meticulously and divinely traced. Whether you are conscious of it or still groping in the dark, seeking answers, something within you has always known that a greater mission was waiting. Your heart, often restless and anxious, feels the vibration of a destiny that cannot be denied. There is a sense of urgency that pushes you to seek more, to delve into your own soul in search of answers that no one else seems to have. God chose you to bear fruits of life here on earth, to be a channel of transformation in a world thirsty for hope. You realize that you do not fit into the patterns of the world, as if you are out of sync with the frenetic pace of society. While everyone seems to chase after what is material, your soul longs for something beyond the tangible, something money cannot buy. And this, in itself, already distinguishes you from the rest. Like Moses, who even raised as a prince, felt like a stranger in the palace, you feel that there is something inside you that does not conform to the common, 
that yearns for truth and justice, even when it sets you against the tide. Many spend their lives searching for meaning, trying to find their place in the world, while you, almost imperceptibly, have always carried the answers within. Perhaps you do not yet fully understand them, but the certainty that you are part of something greater pulses strongly in your veins. Your gifts, talents, and abilities were shaped from the beginning to prepare you for this exact moment. Nothing is by chance. Every experience, every pain, every victory, and every loss prepared you for the role that only you can fulfill. Perhaps you wonder why you were chosen, what makes you different or special. Souls choose their life path before incarnating on Earth. Each soul, in collaboration with the Divine, selected every detail of its existence for this earthly experience. Most souls decided not to take on a great life mission because it would mean facing enormous sufferings, intense challenges, and significant sacrifices. They opted for a less challenging path, and there is nothing wrong with that. Every journey is valid and important. However, there was an urgent need for volunteers to incarnate on Earth and assist in the ascension, in the awakening of collective consciousness. These souls would be the frequency holders, the light bearers, the chosen ones. There was also a need for spiritual teachers, community leaders, and individuals in positions of influence who could guide others towards paths of love and enlightenment. Understandably, many souls chose not to volunteer for these greater missions due to the challenging terms of the spiritual contract. Being chosen does not mean that one soul is better or superior to another. It simply means that it answered the call and was willing to face the challenges that would come. Many of the chosen ones were handpicked. These souls have incarnated on Earth numerous times and possess vast experience, wisdom, and accumulated knowledge necessary to aid in the transition to the fifth dimension, a higher state of consciousness. They sacrificially agreed to endure a difficult life for the greater good of humanity, accepting the sacrifices it would bring. Despite the difficulties and setbacks, being chosen can also mean receiving favors, blessings, and special rewards, which we will explore further. Often, words like thin-skinned, hypersensitive, weak, indecisive, insecure, misunderstood, prone to doubts, self-critical, isolated, unable to make firm decisions, sensitive, reactive, moody, and false are used to describe the chosen ones. These words may have been thrown at you at different times in life, perhaps by people who do not understand the depth of your nature. However, these characteristics are, in fact, signs of a unique emotional sensitivity and depth. This sensitivity allows you to understand and feel the world more intensely and authentically, setting you apart from the crowd. You see nuances that others do not, feel emotions that others ignore, and sense energies that go unnoticed by most. Your sensitivity is not a weakness, but a window into perceiving the world in a way that few can. You feel others' pain, intuit the emotions hidden behind smiles, and are capable of offering solace even when no one understands what you are going through. Like the Good Samaritan, you lean in to help, even when it costs you your own peace. This is more than an act of kindness. It is a reflection of the mission you carry in your heart. The Chosen Ones focus more on others than on themselves. They may appear reserved or temperamental, but this is because they deeply absorb others' emotions, feeling them as if they were their own. You pay more attention to others' needs than your own, often putting yourself second to ensure the well-being of those around you. This deep empathy is a gift, but can also be a heavy burden to bear. They attract negative energies that can cause psychological imbalance. As great listeners and advisors, many people are drawn to your sincere and compassionate nature, confiding in you their problems and pains. This leads to an accumulation of emotional baggage that is hard to release. You may feel overwhelmed, 
emotionally and mentally exhausted, carrying weights that are not originally yours. This load can cause symptoms of depression, anxiety, and stress. But it is important to recognize that these emotions result from accumulated energy and do not reflect personal weakness or instability. Frequently, you lack energy due to your intense ability to feel what others feel. The emotional overload can cause chronic fatigue, headaches, insomnia, and other physical issues. Therefore, you prefer to relax and rest to restore energy, understanding the importance of self-care to continue helping others. You are biologically programmed to be more sensitive. You carry others' emotions and energies, causing a lot of emotional tension. Activities that are common for others can be extremely disturbing for you. For example, watching violent movies or working in stressful environments may be too much for your sensitivity. However, your mental strength is evident in your ability not to succumb to these challenges, finding ways to handle the emotional overload and keep moving forward. The Chosen Ones take longer to consider all emotional aspects before making decisions. They may be seen as indecisive or slow, but their careful and empathetic nature makes them deeply evaluate the implications of each choice, not just for themselves, but also for those who will be affected by their actions. This deep consideration is a sign of responsibility and compassion, not weakness. You experience a full range of emotions, but feel everything more deeply. This can include moments of great joy and happiness, as well as periods of intense sadness. The important thing is to understand that this emotional intensity is an intrinsic part of who you are, and not something to be suppressed or avoided. Your ability to feel deeply allows you to live life with authenticity and passion. You value harmony and seek peaceful ways to resolve conflicts. Confrontations can be extremely emotionally draining as you deeply feel the conflict and tension involved. Instead of avoiding confrontations out of weakness, you avoid them to maintain peace and protect your emotional well-being and that of others. While highly competitive environments can be challenging, you can thrive in places that respect and value your sensitivity. You use your empathy and intuition to help others and make meaningful contributions. Often you excel in careers that involve caring for people, creativity, and problem solving, where your unique skills are highly valued. You may be perceived as antisocial because, after intense interactions, you need time alone to recharge your energies. You appreciate deep and meaningful connections, but the constant bombardment of others' emotions can be exhausting. Taking time for yourself is not about avoiding people, but a form of self-care necessary to maintain your well-being. Despite appearing calm and serene on the outside, you frequently face internal emotional storms. You feel others' emotions so deeply that you can become a vortex of intense feelings. Maintaining a calm appearance is a way of dealing with this intensity but inside you may be processing a great amount of complex emotions. Being chosen comes with enormous burdens. The journey is marked by profound sacrifices, intense spiritual battles, and moments of loneliness. These challenges are part of the process of spiritual refinement and growth. You face internal and external struggles that test your faith and determination. The enemy recognizes that you have been marked for a special purpose and tries to divert you from your path. These battles do not indicate defeat, but preparation for the elevation that is to come. You encounter situations where your faith is constantly tested, moments when isolation seems to be the only refuge. Loneliness becomes a companion, not because you chose this path, but because the weight of being different separates you from the crowds. This isolation, though painful, is also an opportunity to delve deeper into yourself, to listen to the inner voice, and to reconnect with the purpose that is always present, even on the most difficult days. Internal conflicts are intense. 
You feel the pressure to live up to expectations that are not always clear and carry a self-criticism that never seems to silence. There is an internal demand to do more, to be better, to never stop fighting, even when your strength seems to be lacking. Every decision is carefully weighed, as you know that your choices have an impact that goes beyond your own life. Often, you feel isolated, as few understand the weight of your calling or the depth of the sacrifices you make. This solitude is not a punishment, but a time when God works deeply in you, refining your faith and preparing you for what is to come. It is in these moments that you develop resilience, courage, and an even deeper connection with the divine. You are called to leave your comfort zone and face sufferings that many will not understand. These sacrifices shape your character and strengthen your connection with the divine. The ability to feel deeply can be exhausting. You absorb others' emotions and energies, which can lead to physical and mental exhaustion. You are often misunderstood and judged by those who do not understand your sensitive nature. This can lead to feelings of isolation and misunderstandings in personal relationships. Despite these challenges, your sensitivity is not a weakness, but a powerful strength that allows you to connect deeply with the world around you. It is through this sensitivity that you can offer compassion, understanding, and unconditional love to those who need it most. The rewards of being a chosen one are immeasurable. A deep connection with God is one of the greatest blessings you can experience. This intimate relationship goes beyond conventional religious practice. It is a constant communion that brings peace, purpose, and guidance. You feel God's presence in all aspects of your life, manifesting through synchronicities, dreams, repeated numbers, and heightened intuition. Children and animals are often drawn to you, recognizing your inner light and purity of spirit. You are not only guided, but also protected from dangers and adversities. This protection manifests through divine guidance, mental clarity, and emotional strength, allowing you to face challenges with confidence and resilience. Surprising paths open, and you meet people who significantly impact your journey. These opportunities are not coincidences, but part of the divine plan to lead you to the fulfillment of your purpose. When aligned with the divine will, the resources needed to fulfill your mission begin to flow. You receive material blessings that allow you to live in comfort and security, facilitating the realization of projects and dreams. These blessings are not just for your personal benefit, but also so that you can help others and contribute to the collective well-being. You become a beacon for those who are lost, even if they never perceive the light you radiate. There is an invisible force that guides and protects you, opening paths that once seemed impossible. This divine protection is a confirmation that, despite the struggles, you are exactly where you should be. The doors that open, the opportunities that arise from nowhere, and the feeling of being constantly supported are signs that you are not alone. You access a source of deep and intuitive knowledge, ancestral wisdom that helps you navigate life with perspective and discernment. This wisdom connects you with the natural cycles of life, allowing you to recognize and honor the rhythms of nature, cultural traditions, and ancient teachings. You understand the importance of respecting the wisdom of those who came before and integrating these teachings into your daily life. You feel a deep and almost mystical connection with the natural world. Nature responds to you in surprising ways. Plants flourish under your care, wild animals approach with confidence, and you notice signs and messages in natural elements. This harmony brings peace and tranquility, helping align thoughts and feelings with the divine purpose. You may develop a keen intuition about natural cycles and weather patterns, sensing when a season is about to change or when significant natural events are about to occur. 
This sensitivity reflects your deep connection with the flow of life and the order of the universe, allowing you to live in harmony with the world around you. You are empowered to help others, endowed with the skills, resources, and wisdom needed to make a difference in the lives of those around you. You receive a clarity of purpose that guides your actions toward the common good. Your deep empathy and emotional sensitivity allow you to connect on a meaningful level, understanding the pains, fears, and hopes of others. You offer concrete and effective help, whether through natural talents or acquired skills, guiding, teaching, or simply being a supportive presence. The spiritual protection you receive ensures that you have the resources needed to help others. Your life and actions serve as a powerful example of faith, courage, and generosity. You inspire those around you to also seek ways to make a difference, becoming a beacon of hope and a model to follow. To overcome the burdens that accompany being a chosen one, it is essential to set boundaries to protect your emotional energy. Taking time for yourself allows you to recharge and process the absorbed emotions. Finding a community of people who share this journey can provide support and mutual understanding, helping you feel less isolated. Practices like meditation, prayer, and spiritual study strengthen your connection with God and provide tools to face challenges. Cultivating healthy habits, such as physical exercise, balanced nutrition, and adequate sleep, also contributes to your overall well-being. You play a crucial role in the universal balance, bringing light and understanding where it is most needed. By embracing who you are and the purpose for which you were called, you not only find personal fulfillment, but also inspire and uplift those around you. Your journey, though challenging, is essential for the evolution and prosperity of your generation. Therefore, my friends, being chosen is more than a mission. It is a state of being that continues to evolve, even when you are not actively pursuing a goal. The call never ceases, but adapts to the circumstances of each life phase, guiding you to new horizons and new ways of serving. Each challenge is an opportunity for growth, each victory is a step closer to the purpose, and each day is a chance to make a difference, no matter how small. In the end, the journey of the chosen is a continuous cycle of giving and receiving, learning and teaching, falling and rising. And as long as you remain faithful to your call, the light you carry will never be extinguished, illuminating not only your path, but also that of everyone fortunate enough to cross your way. The mission continues, and you, like a beacon amid the storm, remain steadfast, fulfilling the purpose for which you were created. Thank you for taking the time to reflect on this message. May you continue to be guided, protected, and blessed on your journey. May your light shine brightly, illuminating the way for others and contributing to a more compassionate, loving, and conscious world. Your existence makes a difference, and the world is a better place because you are in it. Never underestimate the impact your actions, words, and presence can have on the lives of others. You are needed, you are loved, you are a chosen one.